a lava field, ocean views, and a container home. Those are all very beautiful in themselves, but what if I told you you could have all three of those together in one stay? We are here at this Airbnb. It is an off-grid container home on volcanic lava rock and right next to some gorgeous ocean views that you can walk to your own private shoreline. I'm gonna be giving you a tour of this place today, one of the most unique and beautiful emphasis on both of those Airbnbs I've ever seen. So let's go check it out. Uh, if you want to check out this place, the link is down below, or if you want to become a host, the link is down below. This is the most unique place I have ever been to, and what I'm about to show you guys, it is truly incredible. Share this video if you think this is incredible as well. We are on a volcanic lava field. I don't know anywhere else in the world that you can be on a volcanic lava field as an Airbnb, especially a container home if you're a fan of container homes. So whenever you arrive and book this place, you drive on this road road for a couple miles that goes through the volcanic lava field so your drive here is very beautiful as well on the left and right it's just black rock everywhere you see and you keep driving and you can see where some spots the lava didn't hit and there's just patches of green life and then you make it to your Airbnb and it is a container home that is off the grid so what this is it is a two container home unit combined into one so there's more space in it and it is solar powered you can see the solar panels up on top of it and you might be wondering what this huge round basin is it is not a swimming pool this is where they collect the water and use it for your home and it goes through some systems to purify and everything so this is a totally off-grid unit so this is actually two airbnbs in one there's actually three containers here there's one over here on the left and then there's a double two containers over here on the right i'll be giving you a tour of the two containers over here on the right so that's where i stayed in uh, whenever you get here, you can see just the surrounding area is absolutely beautiful. This is the view from the front of your container home. It's just lava rock up until the ocean shoreline, which is super cool. We're going to be walking up to the ocean, and that is the most beautiful spot I've ever seen in the world later in this video, so stay tuned for that. Uh, you have a porch over here in the front of your container home, and the seating out here is really cool. It's like a lava rock dining table. They have some chairs out here, and then the table is all made from the lava rock so if you want to have dinner out here on the lava rock in the lava field it would be a really cool experience but we'll take a walk inside through this middle sliding door and take a tour of the container home whenever you walk in the space is really large in here and it's bright and it's really spacious actually for a container home uh, this is all an open area concept you have your dining table is the first thing you'd run into in here and then over here on this left side is your living room area you have your couch right here you actually have a small TV in case you want to do something in the middle of the night I would say or watch some Netflix or some Mandalorian and then you can actually transform this couch into an additional bed if needed and then over all the way on the back wall is your kitchen area that takes up this whole back wall on the left side you have a washer and dryer and then you have your sink and all the countertop and then the cabinets this huge window right behind it and then you have your fridge and then an oven and a microwave so it's a full kitchen setup which is really nice in here so this is your main area and you have all these doors over here on the sides we'll start by the door that is next to the washer and dryer you walk in and this is one of your bedrooms it's just a bed in here there's a rack in here to hang up any clothes or anything but this is a very simple minimalistic uh, container home and bedroom I would say since you're living off the grid you walk out of that and the next door over is your other bedroom it's the exact same layout except this one has a sliding door out onto your porch which is super cool so both bedrooms right here uh, is super simple it's just the bed you're supposed to spend your time outside I would say <laughs> and then on the other side of this home this door right next to the fridge is your bathroom this bathroom is a lot different than the rest of the container home it is the stone on the ground that kind of bleeds into your shower and you have this huge shower over here on this other side and I love the rock and stone uh, it's not like the lava rock or anything so it just stands out and it's just different and nice you also have this super cool vanity right here and the sink is really neat I would say and you have a fully functioning toilet and hot water in here which is really nice you, sometimes you don't get that in off-grid stays and then the last door over here is your master bedroom I would say this is where your king-size bed is and you have another sliding door that leads 
leads out onto the porch. So if you want to sleep in here, you can just leave the curtains open and you could go to bed looking out into the lava rocks and the sunset over here. It's super beautiful, I would say. So that is the inside of this unit. It's bright, it's large. Uh, you could sleep a lot of people here. If you slept two per bed, that's six people plus somebody up on the couch. So it's very practical and just a once in a lifetime experience to come out here bring some friends and experience being out here in the private lava rock there's not many people out here as well it took a couple miles of just driving through the lava rock uh, to get out here so it's really off-grid and secluded so now for my favorite part of this Airbnb and one spot I will never forget and I don't think you could get this anywhere else in the world. So you take a stroll through the lava rock and we're going to head to the ocean. It's about a 20 minute walk but you get to enjoy the beautiful scenery that's all around. I love to see the ripples through the lava and how it folds and it cracked and everything and climbing and hiking through it and you can start to see some plants uh, begin to grow through it which is really cool to see how life can just come out of these rocks again and I'm sure at one point in time this will be all green once again. Super cool though and then you walk and you continue and then now you reach the shoreline and this is the most beautiful area on the planet I would say. You have these cliffs right here on the shore where the lava came and it just stopped right here and over on the right side you can kind of see where the shore kind of curves around and this is where the sun sets and if you do a 360 view there is nobody around right here. The water is super blue you get to watch it splash up on the mountains over here and this is a tranquil experience for sure. Being out here alone and private, uh, it's not too dangerous I would say, just don't get close to the edges and watch out for, just don't get close at all to the edges because that would just be dumb anywhere. So if you're staying back, it's totally safe and it's very, very beautiful. If you don't like the container home or the Airbnb, you have to book the spot just to go check out the coastline because it is truly beautiful. So this, it really sells this Airbnb everything the container home being in Hawaii and this coastline is beautiful so if you want to book this place the link is down below very awesome experience share this video with some friends there's some new merch go check out the homies merch if you want to buy some and thank you for watching this video guys I'll see you next week with another Airbnb video